Soul purpose. How often do you recognize your soul purpose? So some of you know me, some of you may not. And I wanted to just kind of talk a little bit about what I do and why I do it through my soul purpose. So I work with the soul, helping people to recognize their spiritual beings in a human body, helping them to recognize their soul can offer them messages and can help them tune in to that purpose within them. So this past year, I ended many spiritual contracts I had made, helping my parents transition, seeing both of my kids get married, starting committing to their families. And so with that, an opening, a portal of energy occurred. Now, that can be a little scary. What am I supposed to be doing? How am I going to go forward? Out of the void comes newness. So through working with my sole purpose, that doesn't change. I was able to open up through the reflections of my students, my clients, and see how powerful working with the soul, working in the deep records of all the many lifetimes can help you break old patterns and move forward in your life. So today on the Empowered Spirit Show, I offer a group healing because I've noticed in humanity right now through the purpose that I do that there is a lot of anxiety, a winding up, hurry, 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 human trait. There's also a feeling of isolation and loneliness, human trait, disconnecting from source. And there's also a little bit of fear still running around. We're glad to be out of the pandemic and things are bouncing back, but will it happen again? another human trait. And so through this soul clearing, I hope it will help you to release these feelings, this anxiety, this struggle, and open up deeper and deeper to your soul and what you've come in to do in this lifetime. Check it out. You can find the Empowered Spirit Show on all your favorite podcast platforms. To your spirit. <laughs>